what do you what do you have to say to people that fear solar maybe don't understand it why that's all i could say why fear it there's no sense it, it it's not something to be fearful of i mean it is something that can certainly help you know energy efficiency you know you hear about the carbon footprint and everything can reduce that you know so it's it's something that we all need to embrace education is everything I, I think that the public needs to be educated the builders need to be ed educated um, our students need to be educated uh, it's the only way we can change over 100 building industry association members from its Orange County chapter converged on SunTrek's Irvine, California headquarters to learn more about how to best integrate solar energy into their new home project. This determines which roofs and which homes have the most feasible sites for solar energy systems. Ones that are clean and rectangular. SunTrek industry CEO Roy Hine shared his belief that solar energy is part of the solution for the building industry and that solar can actually help sell homes in a down market. When a builder commits to building a solar energy home with solar hot water and solar electricity, the homeowner enjoys tax credits and rebates and the benefits are immediate. Even though the addition of solar may raise the selling price of the home, the actual monthly cost to live in the home is less expensive than it would be if the homeowner did not have solar. Well, I'm interested in solar. I think um, the industry has reached a uh, turning point and it's become economically feasible and profitable um, to put in solar units on commercial construction, residential construction. So I'm trying to get smart on the industry and the products that are out there and the technological advances that are right at our uh, doorstep right now and, uh, and take advantage of uh, the industry as it stands now. The green building is everywhere now. People are saying it's coming. Well, it's already come. The governor has signed some legislation just today saying, you know, setting a, a floor for a green building. So it's important that, you know, all levels of our communities understand, you know, various elements of green building. Everyone wants green, but there's a, you know, a lot of information out there and people are trying to shift through it. Well, as far as solar and as far as green, the importance is really not to mandate this. The voluntary is most important. I mean, our builders are and the general population have already are already going down that path. And, you know, I don't think mandating it is necessarily the right direction to go. At July's Solar Energy Showcase, BIA members enjoyed a thorough question and answer session. They made their way to SunTrek's roof to view how solar works in the commercial environment, and they toured a local Power of Three home to see how solar energy works in concert with pool, hot water, and electricity. I, th I think today, you know, it, it was a great opportunity for the participants to really get some their hands on the, the financial aspect of it. You know, we went over a lot of, you know, how much it costs to put in a new system, how much it costs to put in into a design of the system, and also how to retrofit. You know, because let's face it, you know, all three are important elements, and I like the idea of the power of three. I think, you know. A lot of people are looking at it, you know, especially right now. People just want to know that um, that the industry is mature, that it's here to stay, and uh, that it does make economic sense uh, for the homeowner, in particular, um, uh, to move forward with solar when you can integrate it into the initial cost and amortization of the uh, of the project. Then it makes sense, economic sense, as well as structural sense. In all, the Solar Energy Showcase offered a tremendous opportunity to focus on possibilities instead of limitations, to get important questions answered, and to see in person the many benefits of solar in our day and age. But there is a great payback for it, you know. Uh, over a fairly short period of time, you're going to get paid back for that cost, you know, offsetting your electric bills. Um, there are, you know, currently there are great um, government incentives to do it, so, you know, now's the time, jump in. This was an excellent turnout. This just goes to show how important, you know, all elements of green building are, how our builders and our contractors are trying to disseminate through all the information they're receiving and get some factual information, and this was an example of how they can be more energy efficient. 
just reinforced my belief in the need of being more conscious of what we're doing to our environment. And I'm sure that many of the builders who were present here today, they will give consideration to uh, using solar energy in their projects because it's beneficial to them from a money point of view as well as it's beneficial to the buyers. We have to convey that message and that's what this was all about today, is conveying the message and seeing how we can make it cost effective and also a useful tool for the consumer. Learn about it. Bring these people into their offices and, uh, and learn about the industry as it stands now and where it's going. Uh, it does make economic sense and um, uh, the, the, the briefing this morning was very effective. Everybody was nodding their heads and these are a bunch of smart industry people that have been around uh, the building industry, both commercial and residential, for a long time and I, I, they're believers. Look for coverage of green educational happenings now and in the future on Suntrex Solar Network.